Gamers, I'm Daniel, this is Quarrelus, and you are still in the workshop. I'm giving you guys a quick update for the Philadelphia Splash. This is a tank we built for the Renaissance Academy. Uh, we got a lot going on. I just wanted to show you guys some of the final details that we put on here and some of the things that we had to do. So I'm swamped as usual. I'm trying to use my morning as um, wisely as I can because my time is going to get busy later on. We have a fish delivery coming and we have a bunch of other supplies and things that we're getting ready for. So, since this channel, who knows what's going to happen with this channel, um, like I said, as we get more Patreon supporters and more people start to follow us and watch, I'll start to do more projects, we'll start to show you guys more about the reefing hobby and other things that we're interested in, not just the saltwater community. So, this is just going to be, like I said, arts and crafts and for the love of life. Pretty much, if you watch this channel, you're just an interesting person, probably. I'll just take it out like that. But, check it out. This is the castle tank. It's incredible. I'm super psyched. And what I'm doing right now, we did carve this out of foam. Okay, guys, this is nothing special. It's just a low density foam. We sanded it, we carved it, uh, we painted it, airbrushed it, all that fun stuff. But now, to make it protected so nobody can damage it, we're going to paint it with a special epoxy resin and hardener. So when we take this to the library, the kids won't be able just to accidentally kick it or scratch it or break it. It will be very well protected. I call it bulletproof because the more coating I put on there, the stronger it will become. So basically, I'll probably do about three coatings on here. I don't want to take away too much detail, but I want it to be protected. So I will epoxy this whole entire thing. Check out the detail one more time. I am rushing you guys, but if you're new to this channel, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Um, I want to say we get maybe a hundred new people a month to subscribe. Um, you know, we're still a new channel, but that's a hundred people each month who's never seen us before. And I really appreciate you guys. So if you're watching this right now, thank you so much for being a part of our channel and feel free to give us some feedback and let me know what you think. And if you guys want to see the back side of things, check it out. So this is what it looks like on the front, okay? And you can see how deceiving life can be, right? That's some faux brick right there. And on the back, you just got packing materials. Guys, we took these out the trash. This is all recycled. Everything in here is recycled, right? So what you see is not always reality. So, <laughs> but when we're done, like I said, I hope hopefully people will just see the castle. They won't even be looking at it like that, but just figure I'd fill you guys in. So if you have any questions or want to try this yourself, I would love to hear about it. So those of you who are artists and enjoy creating things, let us know if you have a project idea for us or if there's something you want to see because, I mean, the possibilities are limitless and I'm just tired of boring tanks. You know, the other day I was looking at all the stands and all the tanks that come in. I'm like, come on, man. Boring, boring, boring. Um, nothing against people with just a black or white stand, but we now have our own vinyl cutter machine. We make stickers. So we're just saying goodbye to boring and we're going to try to liven things up a little bit. So we are going to have these custom tanks available and I'm going to start working on that. So right after Philadelphia Splash, you guys are going to be seeing a whole lot of new stuff coming towards us. That's why I had to change the hours with the store because I really want to focus on my customers and not try to do both and multitask with me doing other stuff and ordering and a lot of stuff that it takes to run a business and people just, you know, when they come in and they got a question, I want to be over there to serve you. So I'm going to have times that you can come and ask me or time that you'll know Ed's schedule and Ed's over there. He's a coral expert for now. Um, I mean, he's really helping everybody at the store when I can't be there. So you guys can always go to Ed for um, coral questions and he's answering people on Facebook, uh, Instagram, we got the YouTube comments. So, all right guys, thanks for helping us out. Share this video with a friend, help spread the curiosity. Those of you who are long-term reefers, you understand the addiction to the fish tank world and pretty much everything out, else out there is addicting as well. I mean, we got reptiles, um, chameleons. We started off with one, by the end of the day, we had three, so, so that's just that. But all right guys, I've given you a quick tour of the shop. Um, so have a great day. I'll give you guys an update later on once the fish are done and I'll give you a better layout of the video booth and what else we're setting up and hopefully I'll get the hologram projectors done as well. So, all right guys, 
Danny signing off. Thanks for watching. As always, happy reefing. Until next time.